Hello everyone in the multiverse and beyond. This is your friend forever, Evan LeFavor, with an important video. Today we're going to be speaking about the truth, about the Illuminati Evanism connection to Groundhog's Day. The truth about the holiday Groundhog's Day and the film Groundhog's Day and how it all relates to the truth about what is really going on in this universe. So Groundhog's Day is not just a holiday about seeing if a, a groundhog is going to see its shadow or not. All right. It actually runs a lot deeper than that. There's a deeper meaning to the Groundhog's Day celebration, the date, February 2nd. Okay. There is a deeper meaning and a deeper story behind it and that first came into light in 1993 when Harold Ramis who you might know him from the movie Ghostbusters he's the guy who played Egon he directed a movie called Groundhog's Day with Bill Murray and in this movie the the movie Groundhog's Day is about a man who has a tremendous ability to relive the same day over and over again and he learns new things each time he relives his day over each time he wakes up and it's the same day Groundhog's Day over again and he gets to use what he learned about from reliving the same day over and over again to try to manipulate the day to go whatever way he's basically been given this power but he's being tested in how to use that power all right and he can even die and if he dies he just goes back to waking up the next day alive again on Groundhog's Day so you could look at it what he's going through as being a blessing or you could look at it as, as being a curse but that's what the film Groundhog's Day is all about you should check out the movie if you have not seen the movie Groundhog's Day it is one of the best movies ever made all right but in this movie Bill Murray he is playing the part of Father Time Saturn the Grim Reaper me Evan LeFavor all right because this is this movie groundhog's day is actually based on a real story a true story surrounding not only groundhog's day but the the film groundhog's day as well all right because all right first of all in the kingdom of heaven we have technology like you see in the film the matrix that allows us to recreate any day in the history of planet earth so we can simulate time travel to any day in the history of planet earth and you can do whatever you want in a consequence free reality where it's perfectly simulated you interacting with that day wherever you want on planet earth and you can relive that same day over and over again as many times as you want so you can simulate what bill murray has the power to do in the film groundhog's day you can literally do exactly what he does and relive the same day over and over again and do different things in that day and be immortal and invincible and be able to do whatever you want all right because it's like the movie the matrix it's technology that you can project your consciousness into that's indistinguishable from real reality right it's highly advanced technology and in the kingdom of heaven and it allows you to do this to simulate time travel to simulate reliving the same day more than once you can do this in the kingdom of heaven it's really cool technology but you see it goes deeper than that you see in an alternate future i died 
All right. And then when I died, I went to the kingdom of heaven for a while in the afterlife. I entered into the afterlife again and went to the kingdom of heaven for a while to figure out a new plan. And then I time traveled back into my own body on Groundhog's Day in the past with enough time to uh, prevent my death from occurring and create a new fate. All right. So I literally relived Groundhog's Day more than once. All right. Because Groundhog's Day for me is a portal date, a temporal portal, portal in the space time continuum. And it's kind of like if you've ever played video games, it's like having a safe state or a save point where you can go back to if you die or you can go back to at other times or anytime you want. It's like that. I have a temporal uh, save point where on Groundhog's Day, where I, if I die in the future, I can time travel back to Groundhog's Day. All right. So, and I've actually gone through this. And the first time I did it, it's a very disorienting experience going from being alive in the future to dying to going to the kingdom of heaven and being in the afterlife for a while and then returning to planet Earth in the past before you died. It's a disorienting experience because you get a little form of amnesia. You don't really remember what you were doing. It's like there's so much on your mind I don't know it's hard to explain but it's not an easy experience and <clears throat> there's another video another movie based on the truth okay there's another movie based on my true story called the butterfly effect all right and in the butterfly effect, the character Evan is based on me, Evan Lefebvre, and my ability to time travel within my own body, using my sp spirit to time travel into the past. Okay? But on Groundhog's Day is one of the temporal points in which I time traveled to the past after I had died and got a second chance at saving the world all right so that is the true story about Groundhog's Day because I've lived it all right I've lived the same Groundhog's Day more than once all right I've and you know like I said in the film Groundhog's Day Bill Murray is not just playing a regular human being right he's playing father time me Evan Lefebvre, all right, and he is just getting used to his power of being able to relive the same day over and over again and make different choices and see how it ripples throughout the multiverse. So now you know the truth. So each, each time that Groundhog's Day comes around, you know now the true significance of the holiday. All right, you can watch the movie Groundhog's Day and you can experience the true the true story about what really happened and what I've been through because it is based on a real story. All right. So so check out Groundhog's Day if you haven't and make sure to check out some of my other videos. In case you're new, check out the Evan LeFavor, the Father of Jesus Christ playlist on my youtube channel and you'll see all the videos you need to see on the subject make sure to subscribe subscribe because i'm going to be making a video in the future about the butterfly effect and the illuminati evanism connection to that movie as well and you don't want to miss out on that all right so make sure to check out groundhog's day and the butterfly effect and stay tuned to my channel because there's more videos coming in the future. So I want to thank you so much for watching. This is your friend forever, Evan LaFaber. And I will see you next video. Until then, bye-bye.